Welcome back. This is our evening prayer for February 22nd. So we say the Lord be with you. And also with you. Let us pray. God and Father of us all, from the rising of the sun to its setting, we give you praise for your faithfulness to us this day and your presence with us in the night. Speak to us in this time that we may see you and ourselves in the light of your truth and love. Amen. Amen. We will now read from Psalm 127. Unless the Lord builds the house, those who build it labor in vain. Unless the Lord guards the city, the guard keeps watch in vain. It is in vain that you rise up early and go late to rest, eating the bread of anxious toil, for he gives sleep to his beloved. Sons are indeed a heritage from the Lord, the fruit of the womb a reward. Like arrows in the hand of a warrior are the sons of one's youth. Happy is the man who has his quiver full of them. He shall not be put to shame when he speaks with his enemies in the gate. We invite you to pause the video now and spend some time praying through this psalm on your own. When you're ready, we will pray it together and enter into a time of petition. Let us pray. Lord, we know that unless you build our house, we build it in vain with all our labor. Lord, we know you guard our city and that if we think we can do it on our own, we do it in vanity. God, we know that it is in vain that you rise up early and go late to rest. You eat the bread of anxious toil and you give sleep to your beloved. God, we know that we are indeed a heritage of you. The, the fruit of your womb are our rewards. And God, we know we are your children and that we are happy to be your people. And we are thankful. We enter now into our petition saying, God of grace, we give you thanks for the times today when we have felt your presence. We pray for the things that we have done, that they would bring you glory. We pay, pray for the projects that we left incomplete and the work that we have saved until tomorrow. God of forgiveness and love, we pray for the sins and the missteps of the day. We pray for those we have wronged through our words, our actions, and our inactions. And as we prepare to rest, give us your grace so that we may be refreshed to continue to do your will and follow after you closely in the new day tomorrow. Amen. Thanks for joining us today. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye.